Get ready gamers, it's time to determine the ultimate champion of budget gaming mice available at Walmart. Our contenders are ready to battle it out and we'll be putting them to the test to see which reigns supreme. But let's not forget our amazing video sponsor, Lexar, who made this showdown possible. So sit back, grab your popcorn, and let's see which gaming mouse will come out on top after a word from today's sponsor, Lexar. High quality RAM is essential to ensuring you get maximum performance out of your gaming PC. That's why we love using Lexar Aries RGB DDR5 desktop memory. Lexar's Ares RAM is specifically designed for gaming and it shows. This next-gen DDR5 memory delivers peak performance of speeds up to 6,000 MHz. It also features an aluminum heatsink to keep those temps under control during those heavy gaming sessions. Lexar's Ares RGB DDR5 also has built-in power management to enhance efficiency and is designed with on-die ECC to improve stability and reliability. If you're a hardcore gamer or PC enthusiast looking to experience superior performance, check out Lexar Aries RGB DDR5 desktop memory through the links in the description down below. And big thanks to Lexar for sponsoring today's video. We got the eye ship and the slizzard. <laughs> <laughs> you told me to give it a name. Actually, in reality, it's the mystery. Oh yeah, I forgot he named some, the ones that didn't have names. So this is the slizzard named by McAllister. Okay. You go and open yours up. We'll just look at one at a time. Yeah, we'll react yeah. this way. See so. what happens, yeah. Packaging exquisite. It actually has some branding on it, which I'm already noticing that one's very generic. It's like a Model O with a lot more definition to it. Like they really focused on the edges. What, what, what is this? RG, I, I don't even know. RG. It has a picture of a monitor. I got the power device. I yes. got the power. Okay. Ooh, smooth RGB. Okay. That's actually not too bad. That's pretty pretty smooth. That actually. ain't bad. Is oh. that like fake lightweight? It's a fake lightweight. It's a fake lightweight where they just load it up with a bunch of stuff. But <laughs> um, yeah, I guess we'll just see what its competitor is. The Slizzard. It's time for the Slizzard. Shout out to the Slizzard. <laughs> just kidding. It's just a mouse. All right. So let's open it up. Oh my. Wait, what What the heck is this? Wait, is it wireless? I think it's wireless. I oh, like on here. The cable. <laughs> already, already up front, we got six buttons gaming mouse. They make sure you know that on the mouse. It doesn't. Oh my God. They're what? six buttons. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's not. Like, come on. That's no. So um, it's a wireless <laughs> mouse. Does so it have a charge? We got. Off, on, light on. All right, so we'll go light on so you can see the light. Hey, I mean, props to them for not, it doesn't take a double A battery or something at least. I think it's like dead. Is this the Razer Molten Edition? It is the Razer Molten Edition. I'm gonna be kind of shook if we see any actual USB-C mice in this though. Oh God, this is like impossible to plug in. Do you got that light on? This isn't even though? lighting up. None of this is lighting up. I already hate this I'm, I'm gonna save you the effort. Yeet! Oh God. So we're saying iShip moves on. All right, so let's, I guess next up is probably gonna be these ones. Pick Round tech. Two. <laughs> Round two, let's go. Oh, precise <laughs> control. G, G, G Mang, is that G Mang mouse? <laughs> Hold on, what is it. this picture? <laughs> is that a, like a samurai sitting in between laptops? <laughs> it's a really dim light, wow. It's <laughs> RGB. The competitor is uh, Pick Tech. We got PicTech wireless gaming mouse. Okay. Oh, look at this. They present with the uh, USB up top. This one's chunk. This one looks really used. Okay, just McAllister, look at that. Oh. <laughs> look at that. That's that looks a little suspicious. Oh, oh wait, hold up. Ooh. Oh. RGB. That's not, that's not bad. That's not bad. Why what is it flashing like that? Is it trying it to pair it? Oh, did it just die? it died. Oh, it's USB C. USB C. Oh my goodness. This I one is this killing was the it. This expensive one. USB C. USB C Further wins. One. This one moves on. This one, <laughs> Calister, what do you want to do with it? Or does it go there? Yes, there. there. Round three. Round three, McAllister. Oh, this is a toss round. Here we go. Oh, that actually worked. Okay. We thought. All right, we'll start with the round three AGP Tech. This one has a spider on it. It's McAllister's favorite. He loves spiders. Now, that's another really familiar logo. Isn't there a company called like Spider with a Y or something? Yeah, so, wireless. Oh, we're back with the gaming. <laughs> gaming. <laughs> gaming. Uh, um, wireless gaming mouse. Nine different key has different function. Make it easier to operate <laughs> during the game. This thing is chunky. Look at look at the bot just look at the bottom oh of this God. thing. This one looks like some two double A's. Two double A batteries. Do we even have batteries? We don't even have batteries, so we'll just if this one requires batteries then we have to get batteries. But if it doesn't then this one just took an L already. All right, we'll see its competitor. What's the, this one the called? Suzuki 6820. It sounds like a car. It's a Suzuki. Oh my god, it says on it six buttons gaming mouse and it says <laughs> Why is that a trend? Why is that a trend? <laughs> you kind of need the click buttons like why are they counting these? Well, whoa. Oh, <laughs> it's changing colors. It doesn't get me excited. 
I've never seen an optical sensor that's that like bright. Is that safe? Honestly, I think we're picking a wired mouse over I, a wireless I hate mouse. that that not only takes batteries, but it also is not wired at all. Does it even have a dongle or is that Bluetooth only? It has a dongle. Oh, okay. So you at least so, got that going for you, but we yeah, don't want to, we're just... not putting batteries in. This is early rounds. We don't have to do anything extra. No, nah, no. Nah. No. You're moving on. So we'll go over here. <laughs> it's your lucky day. Round four. Oh, here we go again. Can we do this? All right, easy peasy. The TSU mouse. It looks I remember like, that brand. That's the mussy. Oh, it's TSV. Okay, I'm just yeah. Okay, so this one. God, that logo. I swear to God, these are just stealing other it's people's mice. It's like a scorpion. Mice. <laughs> it's just so familiar. That's a whole different model. What does that say? Heist? Heist J? I don't even know, man. These these, these mice companies really do just be like taking each other's mice. But I mean, I don't know. It's it's a mouse. It's. Very basic. It kind of reminds me of like a G305, like wired. Oh, here we go. Uh, you, I don't see, know. you have a bad USB. Bad <laughs> USB. That looks pretty solid, actually. That's not that bad. Right? Uh, but underneath it's the G5 Esports Game Mouse. <laughs> Esports? Esports <laughs> game. I just love Game Mouse. <laughs> Look, they check marked it's black and it has sound. <laughs> <laughs> it's a white mouse. What the carnations? <laughs> if you have bought this, I want you to leave and never come I back. Can I do a quick secret? Yes. What? That is a mouse we pulled from our shelf because we couldn't find the right one, so we have bought this. <laughs> well, I'm gonna plug it up and see if this has any redeeming qualities at all. Because right, oh. It's red. It's red. Oh, is, it gonna, is it gonna change? Oh. 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 This thing is hideous though. Which one? Which one are you picking up? I mean, please this, this and is, thank you. Please and thank you, and get this out of my sight. We're saying that the TSV moves on, and the one that I swear we'd never even said that name does not move on. <laughs> Round five. I got the my dong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we gotta go my dong first. Oh my god! <laughs> what is this? That looks like the wireless one. Where'd that wireless one go? Oh, it does. It does. It has. It's the, the same, same layout. <laughs> is that the same logo? <laughs> Wait, at least now we can actually see what it looks like. Yeah. I mice, we just do the best. <laughs> Look I, at that. I, we just do the best. <laughs> we the best mice. <laughs> we, I feel like I've heard of this brand. Oh, name Vixing, before. we've definitely. Yes, Vixing has been. Uh, we messes before. with Vixing. The box is pretty basic. It says wired mouse, by the way. All right, inside the box. Why does that look very like similar to oh, like team group? All right, this one. This one comes with, comes with a driver. <laughs> Here you go. You gonna frisbee it? Oh, oh wait a minute. Okay, that's there's yeah, no need. Next round! Vixing. Vixing moves on. My dong is no longer my dong. It's our dong. <laughs> okay, so this is round six coming up. That's a class, that's a Ooh, Walmart brand. Hold right up, there. hold up. Walmart's actually in here with yeah. their on brand. Um Ooh. I get the vibe maybe this might have been the most expensive one. I is feel that, like it did was. say one of them was like 25 bucks, and I'm I'm feeling like it's that this one. one? I think it's heavy. The actually. cable does not look lightweight. Either. All right, so um, th look at this. They went for the like lightweight approach, but just shoved so much stuff in there. <laughs> I guess let's point out. You feel this one, and honestly, you'll see that it is not lightweight at all. Oh god, that's it like hundred grand. That's a heavy mouse. Uh, battery jack. The battery jack, and it is. It's wired. I just want that to be known. It's called the battery jack, and it is wired. <laughs> oh, he's. <laughs> A thick ass boy. Dang. <laughs> what? That's oh. too many buns days. Oh man. Invader's <laughs> helmet. <laughs> All right. Um, the RGB is kind of cool, I guess. Is there anything redeeming? That, that's just the design is like. Hey, why does it feel lighter than the light white mouse though? This one is lighter than this one. I, I, I'm gonna give it credit. I feel like for someone like with big hands, especially that looks ergonomic compared to a tiny mouse. I'll be honest, I was like really hating on it because it was so weird looking and so chunky, but like- This just feels it. like false advertising. This feels like false advertising. We can't reward Walmart themselves for false advertising, right McAllister? We don't do that around here. So uh, we decided that, uh, what's this, the battery jack? Yep, the battery, battery jack, jack is moving on. So that goes here. Oh goodness. Yeah, so we have a lot of mice to go through still, so we're gonna do this as quick as possible and uh, give our impressions real quickly. So we have the Ocha King. Oh, honestly, honestly, kind of sick. King. Kind of sick. Let's plug her up. Let's see what she's got. What's under the hood, Ocha King? What you got Wait, there? Wait, that logo. It's the scorpion again. The scorpion has made its way back. It's lighter than... On. It, it's lighter. It's lighter. I don't mean the scale. It's lighter. What do we got? So it says Meteon, but that's a ship <laughs> So, oh, this is this again. <laughs> Honestly, this one's not, doesn't look awful, but this one, it's kind of 
impressive, don't you think? Whoa, whoa, also, whoa. what does this mean? Yeah, all right. Oh, McAllister, run away. Run away, run away, little guy. We're saying, what the hell is this thing this called? This one, the Ocha King. The Ocho Cinco Nueve King is gonna be moving on. Here we go. Yay. Round eight. Fight! I got Vision Tech. I got Run Must. Oh, what Whoa. is this? Metal? Steel? Premium? Steel? It's the Rakuten mouse. <laughs> all right, what's, what's the lighting? What do we got? Ooh, you know, one thing I do have to admit about all these mice, the lighting besides that one, they've all yes. been pretty all right. Okay, I, I mean, yeah, that one looks pretty nice. It feels pretty good. I, you were laughing at this one and I want to know why. <laughs> oh God, it's another one of these. <laughs> I'm so fed up with these. <laughs> I don't get it. It's like, what's the point? <laughs> Round nine. Oh no, oh. I missed it for the first time. I got our boys Hewlett Packard. <laughs> I got the blood bot. <laughs> I like that one better. <laughs> Can be used by both boys and girls. Does it really say that? It says boys and girls. Red. I don't like. Oh, oh, oh okay. Green. I, I don't like. I don't like how it looks. This is incredibly underwhelming. You know, the fact that HP even has something with RGB on is already shocking to me. Red. Green. Okay, so it's kind of not like a very smooth RGB. It's more just like, well, I don't know. I don't know what it's doing. I, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I think HP loses. Yeah, I think um, if it was going against another one, maybe it wouldn't, but HP, we're, we're sorry. I, I love you guys at HP, you're great. We're but sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Yo, hold up! <laughs> <Did> you... <laughs> <laughs> this has seven key cool chicken mouse. No freaking no, no. way. <laughs> Wait. Nope. Oh. Our cool chicken is wireless. <laughs> oh, wow. That's nice. <laughs> this is good, guys. This, you know this what goes good? To beat. You know what goes good on your chicken? Some jelly. Some so we jelly got the jelly. Comb. We got the jelly comb right here. It's like a Logitech mouse. Like, what is this? They both do. That's they, a they, G502. They, that's the G305 or something. Yeah, like that. that's that's interesting. Hold okay. On, this button. <laughs> that's kind of cool, I guess. Whoa. You can't even see it when you're actually using the mouse, really. Like, mm. You like very <laughs> much can't. Like, it's very. It's a 20 footer. Yeah, it's a 20 footer right there. Um, I don't. I don't know, man. I mean, this one's okay. What do you think? <laughs> Chicken or jelly? What, what? Cool chicken wins. Bah! Cool chicken? <laughs> Big coup. All right, I'll go and open mine up. Okay, that's a design if I've ever really? seen one. Uh, oh, it's eye mice again. Shout out eye mice. <laughs> Just do best. <laughs> I, I'm not gonna lie, oh, it's like they put a cage over another mouse. Like, if you feel this all, <laughs> it's just a smaller mouse. That's, a, that's what it kind of looks That'd like. That'd be kind of funny. Uh, let's see what the competitor is. It's already so sticking to me. The POs are. Uh, we've already seen this brand, the Mock PR or whatever. These aren't these are that exciting, I'll be honest with you. No, these, I don't think these ones are gonna make it very far, sadly, guys, but let's just, let's give them a chance. Honestly, Ooh. brighter light versus dimmer light and RGB. I, this design is way nicer for sure. Sorry, uh, iMice, you didn't win this one. Has iMice won anything? I don't think they've won anything. So P.O.'s are RGB <laughs> moves on. Oh. This is the War Wolf. Is that oh. like the one you just saw? There's nothing dumb. I gotta, I gotta read these. Oh my. <laughs> Whoa. So it's another one of the kind of like molten, oh, this one's actually textured. It's a rib for your partner. Another CPI. So, uh, that's actually kind of RGB-like. It's actually smooth and smooth. But you know what? We gotta see if Jellycomb 2, the rendition of Jellycomb, this <laughs> one's worse. Look at this one. It actually says Jellycomb on it. It does say Jellycomb. Look at the back of it, it's a jellyfish. Ooh. Okay, RGB. all right, you know what? It doesn't, it looks like you took an office mouse and added a strip of RGB around it, but you know what? It's it's classy, it's tasteful. I think Jellycomb 2 deserves a chance. Jellycomb, and the first round is complete. So the first round is complete, and we have a lot of pretty good competitors in the 30 or less dollar bracket. And as you can see, semifinals, they're finally commencing. We're super excited. Let's get into it. And then obviously each of the corner, we do have some that are just gonna automatically pass to the next round because uh, spacing. So yeah, that should be pretty easy for those guys to win. Right now we're doing the round two versus round three, which is the Suzy Co versus the Pick Pick Attack. I gotta refresh myself with these. We've seen a lot of mice today. Oh, this is a six button gaming mouse. I kinda wanna eliminate this one just like right now. This is the one that's wireless and USB-C and it's round. Two, this is the winner is moving on. All right, so we have Vixing which I think is a pretty quality mouse. I mean, you can kind of get an idea of what we're working with here. And then this is our TSV, at least we think it is. What do you think? Do you have a strong opinion one way or another? They look very similar besides like... They're both wired. This one I think is like a little more traditional and we, we like our traditions. Tradition is key. Tradition is king, so you like traditional? Which one was traditional? I don't even this see which one you're pointing at. This one's more traditional? All right, that's the winner. <laughs> Move on. TSV. 
is now going to be here. Blood bat's actually pretty solid in terms of its, uh, well, design and everything. We got this uh, braided cable and everything I'm a fan of. The RGB was pretty solid. This is the one that's kind of like, it's, it's interesting to say the least. Interesting I, is not what you say about a winner. Interesting is not what you say about a winner. I, I guess that one moves on. <laughs> the bloody, the bloodiest of bats is moving on. There we go. Chicken. <laughs> it doesn't need any more explanation yeah, other than it. chicken. And this one has stayed on the entire time. Is that the one? And it's also USB-C, I think. USB-C. USB-C is big. At this point, I think wireless technology is what's going to prevail. Even though this mouse overall might not be the best build quality, it, it's chicken chicken. It's chicken. Which combo you picking? So we're on to, which, Jackson, is this the semifinals? It was the quarterfinals. It's the now it's the semifinals. All right, so now we're in the semifinals once again, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, so far, the battle is getting pretty heated. We have the iShip versus the whatever Picatech. Picatech mouse. We got TSV versus the battery jack, which doesn't even use a battery. Um, we got the Ocha King versus Blood Bat, and we got Vetku versus Jellycomb. iShip versus Picatech. iShip, I remember, actually, right, I don't even remember this mouse. <laughs> I, it's like, been two rounds. It's been two yeah. rounds. I do not remember this mouse, but it was born for gaming. <laughs> so I don't know. You gotta say something about that. Well, this is the one that is RGB, it's USB C wireless. I mean, you, can, you, you can't be born for gaming anymore, guys. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I don't know if we can uh, move you on. Your RGB is kind of cool, but. Wireless, USB-C, you really can't compete with that. The Pick Tech moves on. Goodbye, iShip. You're done. This is the TSV versus the Battery Jack. I'll let Matt handle Battery Jack. Oh boy. Your Battery Jack. This one just has such a nice, smooth feel. I will say Battery Jack, I feel like they lose a lot of points just because it doesn't have a battery. This is the one with that unique design though. It's like <laughs> the design that really threw me for a loop. It only won because it was lighter than the on mouse. So does it really deserve to move on beyond this? What do, what do you think? I, I personally like this one more, but it, I mean, this is a big decision, guys. It's a big decision. I'm really sweating about this one, man. <sighs> but let's, let's have a little uh, meeting real quick. You know, it's just, it does have a battery, so we can't win. The battery one is gone. Battery Jack, you lose. Blood Bat and Ocha hey, King. This is this one's gonna be a little spicy. This one's gonna get bloody. This one's gonna get a little bloody. <laughs> so oh, it's it's two two white mice plugging in Blood Bat now, and we have our TSV plugged in. It's weird. I don't Which know. one's lighter? I'm wondering. I'm I'm saying TSV. You're moving on. Blood Bat, you've been exterminated. <laughs> uh, goodbye, Blood Bat. Ocha King, here we go. Dude, I'm so excited that this is the semi 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 finals. <laughs> So we got the Vigu versus the Jellycomb. It's the Jellycomb. Look at the right, jelly fish. But chicken. <laughs> chicken, chicken. The chicken just has so much going for it. Honestly, the chicken one doesn't have much going for it. I just have love for the box. Well, I don't know. It's, it's hard to compare these because like we have wireless USB-C versus wired. The RGB does look nicer on this one, but this one has chicken and it's wireless. And it's I mean, the later rounds we get, I feel like wireless technology, you know, really goes a long way. We're, we're I can't wireless believe I'm guys. saying this because I think this is honestly a better overall mouse, but this one being wireless and chicken, I'm sorry. It is what it is. I'm sorry, we gotta move on. Chicken, chicken moves on. All right, now it's that brings us to the semi-final. <laughs> First time we've ever said that. Starting off with the Picto mouse versus the TSV gaming. Well, so I'm missing something. It's a wireless gaming mouse, I mean. <laughs> I mean, I guess it would be Bluetooth. Bluetooth wireless kind of sucks, but you know, it's, it's something at least. What do you say with that one? Wired. It's wired. China. China. Oh. It's too bright. It's actually kind of weird looking. It is. I mean, but you know what? Connected. Calister, do you have an opinion? The LED is flashing, so I don't think that's a. It's in that pair mode. I would say we sure as hell lost the dongle. <laughs> it's no longer wired. I'm, I'm convinced you know it's Bluetooth. I think but... this one did have a dongle. I do recall there me going. Well, that's oh, their fault. Sucks. Organization <laughs> negative twenty. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Wired. You know what? We do need a wired mouse in the. Sometimes upsets happen. Finals. All right. Wired mouse. We're moving on. The TSV. <laughs> now, this is the matchup you all been waiting for. Place your bets. Does chicken move on? Let me know. Pause the video right now and comment down below. Yeah, so this is the Ocha King and chicken. Chicken. It's the... <laughs> What's the name of the Bing chicken? Q. The Bing Q. Bing Q. 
chicken. I don't think I'm picking a combo today. You feel like you like this one better than chicken. I, I do. I think like it does look it's not super lightweight, but like it just looks better overall. And I know this is a mouse competition. We really haven't tested any of the functionality, but you know what? You're not even gonna pick this thing up if it looks ugly. So you want it to look good. And I don't know, I think I, I'm, I'm feeling that way. I mean, I, I always get giggles. This looking is gonna be at crazy. Chicken. We're gonna have two wired mice only in the end. But all right, let's think. All right, here we go. What would my brain do at this very moment? Wait, you Chicken wins. Here. Chicken wins. <laughs> I changed my mind. This is more exciting though, because now we have a wired one and a wireless one. The buzzer beater. All right, so we got VQ versus TSV or chicken. Or chicken. No, I know, VQ is chicken. So um, mentally, we're struggling a little bit here, but we have made it to the finals, and uh, we have yes, yeah, semifinals. We're the back final to the, is the last. We're back now. to the semifinals here, but this has been my my trooper. <laughs> my trooper has made it through. This is cool chicken mouse, or we like to call the VQ. I just don't want to call it that. It's cool chicken. Yeah. Um, it's wireless. It has some functionality. Um, you know, I do have a complaint. I wish the lighting was like the lighting is pretty even. bad. It is pretty bad. This well, lighting, lie, this one's not amazing either. I almost <laughs> wish that our last white mouse had gotten into this. This this la this one's like, but it couldn't beat the chicken. It's like, hey, you should have picked me. Honestly, you know this is gonna sound stupid. I don't like any of these as the winner. <laughs> none <laughs> of, the, none of these make me happy. But you know what? The tournament. We put a lot of money into this tournament as in not much money. But there's been a lot of participants, a lot of fans. And uh, Jackson, you say yours and I'll say mine. And then we have McAllister's tiebreaker. Chicken. Chicken's the champion! <laughs> Let's Whoa! go, baby! Chicken! It finally turned off. I think it died. It, it, died. it doesn't even it work It won anymore. and it has no will to win. The chicken has won the uh, cheap Walmart mouse tournament. Yeah, I bet you are gonna totally disagree with that, by the way, and I wanna hear it in the comment section down below. Well, all right, guys, as you can see, the mouse that Matt is holding, our Vigu Chicken McChicken Double Chicken Sandwich Mouse, has won. Yes, it is the champion, and if you wanna buy some of these mice, I can't promise you the links are gonna be accurate because I don't think we're gonna be able to find all of them and the names and everything, but we'll leave links down below. If you wanna buy the chicken, let's start a chicken revolution today, ladies and gentlemen. Everyone use a chicken mouse. I wanna see a lot of chicken affiliate, guys. Like, I'm not messing with you all I right wanna now. see some chicken affiliate, but uh, yeah, if you guys like this video, check the links in the description down below. And uh, yeah, it was a great video, fun change of pace. Let us know what you think of it in the comment section. So as always, we hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, check out our other two YouTube channels and also our twitch.tv slash Toasty Bros. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. We got a lot of mice to clean up, so where are we going to sell them? PC Bros. I Tech, as long as we didn't break them when we threw them. Go over to PC Bros. I Tech and uh, buy a gaming PC, and uh, you'll probably come in person for these mice. But if you just go to Toasty Bros. 2, you'll save 2% on your next purchase. See you guys later. Goodbye.